keep my brother-in-law's amused for ages, that. So, Dave, can you see the hands of lots of different people on here? I certainly can. <laughs> Seven owners. You reckon they've all had a dabble at the electrics? Exactly. It just looks like a nightmare to me, but you can just read your way through it somehow. So now you're simplifying it, you're getting rid of some of the trash. Exactly. What we're doing is, um, you've got a lot of redundant kit that you don't need, and the kit that you do need, we're going to simplify. So you're going to try and save the radar, you're going to try and save that old radio, VHF, yeah. Yeah. And, the GPS. and the GPS, and that's going to be it. That'll be it. And that speaker up there, what is that for? Is that for? Uh, this is a speaker for your VHF. So it's is it just, the only just speaker to make it for your VHF. Um, yes, it is on this particular is it? one. Wow. Yeah. See, as a normal boat owner, you're frightened to cut anything. Whereas you can read it through, you go, right, this can go, that can go. Well, I'm familiar with the kit, so I can recognise the um, the wiring. Okay, so we want 86. I don't know why you've got 86 on here. It's 20. No, you haven't got 20. Oh, that's a bit of a bummer. Yeah, well, got... So I won't be able to pick up the weather forecasts? Yeah, yeah. but not on that particular aerial. 23 is the one at the uh, at the Needles, but All it's right. also the one for Portsmouth. The aerial... Uh... Well, that's good. So that's just working from the little bit that's sticking out yeah. by the mast? Yeah, no, it, they will pick the signal up, yeah. but you, you don't want to transmit because you'll, uh, you'll blow it if you All do. right, okay. Well, that's good then. Yeah, so that's another problem solved. Yeah. It is an ugly salt though, isn't it? What? Well, you've got your Coast Guard rescue centres on. What more do you need? They're all dead, aren't they? <laughs> that's historical, aren't they? And how many of those are still open? Yeah, that's a good point. I wonder. That's a very good point. Yeah, because they've killed most of them, haven't they? Yeah, they have, actually. But that's why you've got the three aerials now. Because they an aerial more or less replaced the Coast Guard so you can get all of them. But that's uh, that's good. <laughs> it's counting something, 79, 78. Oh, okay, I can't. Is that firing up? 76? Yeah, oh, that's good, I can't see it from here because yeah. of the sun. Yeah. It's, oh, that's 71, so it's firing itself up, is it? It is, yeah, that's right. And that says 0001 hours, it says. That can't be true. Yeah, it can. can it? It's been running for 10 hours. 0010. No, just 0001 hours. So it's running it for one hour. Is that really true? Yeah, it is. Wow. Must be, it's got a counter in it. It's gone dead again now. Oh, that's cause it's probably cause what you've got is the range. It's got automatic. These are four little boxes yeah. which, which will show you uh, what it's doing basically. It's on auto at the moment, which means you don't have to touch anything. So you have things for uh, adjusting for, for rain clutter, for example. But you need to get the manual level. Well, let's just see uh, whether we're going to work. There you go. Hey, wow. So what's that showing there then? Well, it's showing all the cluster around here for a start. This is the different ranges. Radar. Can't really tell to get to sea, can you? No, so this, this is on three miles now. If you look in this top yeah. box. And there, each ring is half a mile. Oh, okay. 0.5 of yeah, a mile, yeah. in other words. So if I go... So just picking up junk around one, here at the one moment. One point, yeah, there's too much clutter. You've got, yeah. you've got aerials all over the place. Yeah. There's buildings that are a bit too close. The thing is, this type of radar is quite difficult to read the picture until you go out to sea and then they work like magic. Because you do get a lot of cluster and modern yeah. ones don't do that with the, um, with the latest kit. But that's one mile. 0.75, half a mile quarter of a mile range and you can see how wow. it's completed. Does that surprise so, you that it just fired up? No. Yeah. <laughs> you see it's quite a good, uh, there's too, too much clutter on it at the moment yeah. so you can adjust these th these out obviously this shows you what is actually in this little box here. If you look at the small bars it tells you how much it's being controlled but it is on auto at the moment so just best thing is just to leave it like that. That's magic. That is pretty good. So we've got GPS, got radar, VHF, VHF, no echo sounder. But we'll fix that. Yeah. So the maximum range is 16 miles, but with that height of aerial, it won't give you 16 miles anyway. 
This is the old line of sight problem. Pretty good. Quite a good picture, though. I like these red eyes. I like good luck with them. <laughs>